building. Uh, we can have the Amaya family up here with us up front. Thank you so much. We are so excited to be here. I think we're about ready to go. I'm gonna look at my staff. We also will be streaming this on Facebook Live, so we may have some online viewers as well. So once again, thank you so much to everybody who is here with us this morning. My name is Barbara Garza, and I'm the President and CEO for the Wessico Area Chamber of Commerce. Very excited to be here for a sweet ribbon cutting this morning at Nothing Bun Cakes. Let's give them a round of applause. We are joined here with the Amaya family and we're just so thrilled to have Nothing Bunch Cakes here in Westlaco, Texas. And today we celebrate a ribbon cutting commemorating this business here in Westlaco and the continued growth here in this community. And so uh, as we get started this morning, I know that we have a lot of distinguished guests with us here and great community family, friends, everyone who's here, thank you for joining us. I do wanna recognize our Red Coat ambassadors. All of our Red Coat ambassadors are business leaders across the community who come out to support uh, local businesses. So thank you to our ambassadors for being here this morning. I would also like to recognize the Westlaco EDC team who is here, and I believe the entire team is here, so if y'all can raise your hands, all of the EDC team that's here this morning, thank you so much. Uh, I also would like to recognize our city manager, Mr. Martin Garza, who is here with us this morning. The Westlaco EDC executive director, Mr. Steve Valdez. And our city commissioner, Mr. Adrian Farias, who's here with us this morning. Once again, thank you. We appreciate all of you being here, and I would be remiss if I did not recognize our amazing royal court who is here with us. We have Miss Texas Onion Fest, Junior Miss Westlaco, and Little Miss Westlaco here with us this morning as well. Thank you, ladies, for being a part of today's celebration. So to get us started, I would like to invite our city manager, Mr. Martin Garza, to share a few words uh, in today's ceremony. Thank you, Barbara. Good morning. How are we all doing today? Good, good. This is a beautiful day here today for the city of Westlaco. We're so excited to have a new business here in our new complex. And, and there's a lot of people that played a big role, uh, not only for, for uh, letting Bun Cakes to be here, but also for the development. And a lot of us in this team uh, made this a reality for the Amaya family to actually have a place here in Westlaco. I want to thank the ADC bringing in this development, help, uh, helping with the developers and the contractors and making a, a good incentives so they can come to our city here in West Coast. So thank you for the EDC, our city commission, Mr. Farias, thank you for participating on all those important meetings that take place in order to make these type of developments happening. So on behalf of Mayor Suarez and the rest of the commission, we want to welcome the Amaya family. Uh, usually when a commissioner is present in a in a um, uh, meeting or a gathering like today, I like to step back and not say a few words. I let the, I let the elected officials do that. And we're gonna hear from Mr. Farias right now, but I, I, this was something special for me because I know the Amaya family. The Amaya family is, is from Mission, my hometown, and uh, we go way back. Uh, Mr. Amaya, Mike Amaya here actually uh, we, we met at McDonald's when we were 16 years old. We went to school together, but we actually met at McDonald's. And so, you know, being able to see his family grow and being able to see him grow as a businessman, become an entrepreneur himself, an owner of a franchise, it gives me great pleasure to see that from uh, people that I grew up. So uh, I want to congratulate the Amaya family, their beautiful daughters, uh, this is a great thing for your family. They continue to grow. They started in McAllen, went to Brownsville, finally realized that the place to be is in Westlaco. And so we're here. Uh, and so, you know, I just want to tell you that I'm, I'm new to Westlaco myself. I've been here a year and a half, but I can tell you that they have a great family here in the city of Westlaco. Mr. Valdez, the commissioners, Barbara, we're all in the same family. And when we see a business, uh, you know, come up and, and it's a, a family business, it just gives us this great joy because we're all family ourselves. We want to make sure that you succeed. Our doors are open at our office, uh, making sure that whatever we can do for you all, uh, we're here so you can continue staying in business. So again, congratulations to you and your family. Welcome to the city of West. Thank you, Mr. Garza. At this time, I would like to welcome City Commissioner Mr. Adrian Farias to share a few words.
Good morning. Happy Friday, everybody. Thank you all for being here. Mr. Maya family, thank you all. First and foremost, on behalf of the Mayor City Commission, we want to thank you for choosing Wasito. I'm excited and nervous. Excited because it's a great location, a great place, and nervous because I'm not here with my kids, and if they know I'm here, they're going to get mad. So I'm going to have to buy something from you guys before I leave today. But again, thank you for choosing Wasco. We appreciate that. At the end of the day, you could have chosen, you chose McAllen, Brownville, but like Mr. Garza said, Wasco is home to a lot of us, and we're glad you chose Wasco. So thank you guys. And we're here to help. Like Mr. Garza said, we want to see you succeed. Your success is our success, and we're all here to help you. Thank you, Commissioner Farias. And yes, uh, you know, as, as you can see, there's so many of us here to support you today and today's ribbon cutting because we are a family here in Wasico. And uh, at this time, I would like to invite the Executive Director of the Wasico EDC, Mr. Steve Valdez, to share a few words. Thank you, Barbara. Thank you all for coming as well and welcome this morning. Thank the Amaya family for also choosing Wasico. I mean, we can all say great things about our hometown. Uh, the way this whole development happened started years ago. Uh, a lot of times people don't understand the relationships that go into uh, the process that we are experiencing today. But even before these buildings uh, came up from the ground, there was probably years of work that went on with the developer here. This started with the relationship with the EDC uh, and, and the fact that uh, Greg Garensway uh, uh, his, his hustle, his drive, his determination, uh, but first and foremost, his love of Wesleco. Uh, this was his first development. He's already on to his second. And so uh, we, we love to see that other people recognize uh, what we see every day here in Wesleco. And that's, that's not only us growing, but the love and, the, and, the, and the, the friendliness, the compassion that you'll find from the hearts that you see here in Wesleco. So we, we love having you here. Uh, I know uh, we, talk, we talked about being nervous. I'm nervous too because our waistline is going to be affected a little bit. For, but it's okay because uh, we, we love the product. We've already sampled your stuff. Uh, we'd like to, well, to make sure that our community comes out and supports you. Uh, our, our, our initiatives here with the EDC, social media, uh, our staff that uh, Michelle will help in, in any way we can. I know that you've met Maria as well. Anything that, that would have happened in the permitting process, uh, she a lot of times helps that mediation happen between us and the city. And the fact that we have a great relationship with them helps make these days possible. So thank you once again to all of you for, for choosing Westlaco and uh, we just love having you here. Thank you. Thank you, Mr. Valdez. So as you can see, we're so excited for you guys. Everyone is just so excited for this opportunity to be here and celebrate with you. And we want to hear from you, the Amaya family, and ask you about, you know, for those joining us online who haven't tasted the product, talk to us about what, we, what people can expect from Nothing Bun Cakes, and let us know who you are and why Westlaco. Well, thank you so much. I'm overwhelmed with the uh, excitement. Thank you so much for coming out to support us. First, I want to thank you, um, thank my family, they're special to me. Um, sorry, I'm choking up a little bit. Without them, this wouldn't happen, right? So thank you, my wife Lisa, Rebecca, and Abigail. When we joined this, this uh, franchise, it was a family-oriented company. And so it was perfect when we were looking for a business that our family would be involved. So it's, it's a dream come true. Both of my girls are involved. Um, She's my backbone, um, so I really thank you girls. Um, there's been a lot of hands in making this happen, right? The city's been great. My general contractor, Robert Quintanilla, he's awesome, he's family as well. And, you know, he's he's uh, uh, worked with the city as well, and we just were welcome, uh, a lot of support. You know, they asked us, where are you gonna build your next bakery and we're like well we're looking at different cities and Harlingen didn't work out yet and North McAllen isn't working out yet but we came to Westlake and when we say we're going to Westlake people are like you're gonna love it there they're they're like the friendliest town sorry mission but <laughs> <laughs> they're like the friendliest town they're really good they welcome the uh, the, uh, the, the the businesses they're very helpful so and that has become true and i thank you so much for the support and the help also want to thank Catalina. she's here somewhere she lost her voice um she's the manager of the bakery 
Uh, thank you so much for joining us and being part of this. And also her sidekick, uh, um, Erica, sorry, my, my, my voice is kind of weak. I'm sorry about that. So thank you so much for coming out. We appreciate it. Nothing but cakes. We're so proud of this brand that we get to reach out to the community. We love that. And we have such an awesome product. We make everything here, all right? We use the freshest ingredients. It started about 30 years ago with two friends in New York, I'm sorry, in uh, Las Vegas, cooking and selling out of their home. And they made it a franchise and shared it with us. We've been doing this for eight years. We're excited to be in Mission, Westaco now, the middle of the valley, and then Brownsville. We are hoping to, by the end of 2024, we'll be open in North McAllen and in Harlingen. So Robert, get ready for that, right? <laughs> so again, thank you so much. I appreciate the support. We're looking forward to working with the community, with the schools, the chamber, you know, the, the businesses around us. We've reached out. Uh, we've had a lot of support. And thank you so much again uh, for your help. And uh, so I don't know, Lisa, would you like to say some words? or? Again, just reiterating what Mike said, we're just thrilled to be here. Honestly, he's right. Everyone we've spoken to is like, you're gonna love Westaco. They're amazing. They're just such a friendly, friendly city. And it has been true. You guys have embraced us um, so beautifully and we thank you all from the bottom of our hearts. So thank you so much. Thank you so much. And yes, we are a friendly city and we like to call ourselves the heart of the Mid Valley. So welcome to the heart of the Mid Valley. And to continue with our ceremony today, I would like to invite one of our ambassadors to uh, speak and share a few words on behalf of the ambassadors of the Wasico Chamber. So I'd like to invite Mr. Daniel Montes, administrator for South Texas College here in Wasico. I forgot to mention, please share with your family, your co-workers that we're gonna have a grand opening ceremony, uh, not ceremony, but uh, uh, event next weekend. Y'all are invited. Um, so we'll be doing, uh, giving out free pay, we're gonna be giving out um, um, we're gonna do face painting. It's just gonna be a great family event. So thank you so much. I'm sorry. Thank you, thank you. Uh, I gotta echo Commissioner Farias' uh, uh, sentiments. I, I hope my grandsons don't know that I'm here today, but uh, I've been teaching business for 35 years, and one of the things that we teach, that we learn, is that businesses like such as this are really the backbone of our economy. They, they're the ones who spur a lot of the economic activity, and they're the ones who will uh, attract people and other businesses. So it is important to have clients, to have customers that have stores uh, that come here and a lot of times people will come specifically here just for for cakes uh, I live out of town and I've already bought like three or four of the cakes here since you've opened so I know that uh, from personal experience but we do want to welcome you to Westaco and welcome you specifically to the chamber uh, being a part of the chamber is is a membership that is uh, only for select uh, uh, people and select uh, companies and it is something that is very, it shows that you have high standards. And that's something that, that we believe in. And it's something that you have demonstrated by your success. So we'd like to welcome you to the family, welcome you to Westaco, and present you with a little token. It's a, it's a certificate and a plaque that you can uh, put proudly in, in, in your store to let people know that you are a member of the, of the chamber. But more importantly, you have standards that are very high and that uh, people will recognize that quality of your product. And it is something that, you know, your success speaks volumes because of that success and because of the quality of your product. Thank you. We'll take a quick photo. Go look at Anthony up here. Perfect. And before we get into the ribbon cutting, Mr. Amaya, you reminded me of the awesome flyer that uh, Caroline sent me. So I want to make sure to mention these upcoming events. Uh, Monday through Saturday, November 6th through 11th, we have appreciation days. Monday, healthcare workers, Tuesday, teachers and school staff. Wednesday, city employees. City employees, Mr. Garza, you have to let them come. Uh, Thursday, first responders and military. Friday, community and business members. Members of the chamber, everybody hears that. 
Uh, and then on Saturday, veterans. We want to invite everybody out for the appreciation days, November 6th through 11th. And then uh, Friday, November 10th, free confetti bundlets. I don't know if you want me to share that one, but I'm sharing it. First 100 guests, okay? So first 100 guests on Friday. So how many of us are there here? What can we have already taken the first 50, there you go. And then Saturday, November 11th, just like Mr. Amaya mentioned, from 9 a.m. to 10, enjoy face painting and balloon artists, uh, free bundlets for a year, guys. So you have to come out on Saturday, November 11th, 9 to 10 a.m. And what I also wanna mention, I don't know if you wanna share anything about this, is that uh, the funding that you all receive that day will go towards a nonprofit. And you all have chosen a local nonprofit, which we are so thankful to you. You have chosen Aurora House Foundation to donate to. So thank you so much for that. I don't know if you want to share anything on, uh, in regards to the events or anything this coming week. Um, yeah, what we're doing is we're going to be sharing the proceeds about 20% of our sales of that day to the Aurora House. Um, thank you for Carolina. She went out and found um, this uh, a great opportunity to serve our community. And so we're excited. Please come out and support. Um, our fundraiser to, to help them as well. So thank you very much. Awesome, wonderful. Well, thank you so much to my family. And I think that we are ready for a ribbon cutting, yes? Awesome, so let's get everybody together here for a photo. moment folks make sure you're still smiling because these pictures will be everywhere all right and I think we are ready to cut the ribbon if y'all want to join me on the count of three ready Mike are you ready there all right one two and three congratulations to nothing but cakes Wasika. welcome to this community and thank you for having us we want to invite everybody to check out the space if you haven't already come check it out inside and thank you so much for joining us for the ribbon cutting today